little self-care morning just you know to make myself feel a little bit so i've had a shower shaved and all that good stuff moisturized but look at this big ass spot that i got like it's so it's not even that painful but it's just like so big and like under the skin so i'm gonna put face mask off this is a mask of magnum minty from lush it's literally my fave i'm actually done playing my face do i do that before or after putting a face mask on i don't know if anyone who knows do you put do you dermaplane before or do you shave your face before or after with like one of those little face shavers i have no idea my sister's got a wax melt on and i nine months later and i still don't have my sense of smell back but i can smell like it, the smell is there but it doesn't smell as it should like she says it's apple strudel and like it doesn't smell unpleasant but it's definitely not apple strudel doing some smell training with my dad did it the other day i did like blindfolded myself and he puts um set different things under my nose and i had like a piece of paper and scored what i could smell like the garlic i could smell because garlic is very very strong although it didn't it still didn't smell like a hundred percent like it should can't even smell christmas candles it's so sad but yeah right, i'm gonna put this mask on and i will see you guys a bit later hi guys so today we're doing some christmas bacon and we're making some gingerbread men although i can't find a gingerbread man cookie cutter so we've got christmas trees a big christmas tree a star and then i've also picked out a squirrel because i like squirrels there's also like um a moon in there which we could do maybe oh wait there's holly we've got some holly as well so we have everything a chicken. Chicken! That's a chicken if I am. Right, let's measure out. 175 grams. Oh no, it's 375 grams. I've added all the dry ingredients and Jed is just mixing it together. Get in there. So it's, it's like breadcrumbs. It's starting to look like breadcrumbs, is it not? Yeah. Get in there. What, what does he look like I'm doing? What do you mean, to jump in the bowl? Yeah. Okay, so it's all done. Jed's just... Boxing it up. Make sure you get into the bottom. Yeah, I'm getting to the bottom. I literally can't remember the last time I made biscuits dead. It was probably. Nah. Well, oh my god, the Christmas lights, lights aren't on. Maybe we made some dutty ones. Christmas lights are on. Cute. Right, have you done with that yet, hun? Tell me. You tell me. first time in three years that we've done proper baking together and it's going to be the last time if you keep dipping your hair on the fucking thing <laughs> look how red i look because of, oh jenna look like a tomato proper bacon how do uh, you we, i told them we've done the, the shitty bacon where you've got the 500 percent dark chocolate Our cookies. I don't think I showed you them out of the oven. Um, but yeah, this is one tray. We've got another tray over here. But yeah, we're definitely going to decorate them with like some icing sugar, which we're going to make after dinner because I'm just cooking. I'm making a jackfruit massman curry. This is a bit of a stir. And then it also spoiled a few potatoes. We just decorated the cookies apart from the squirrels. Well, two of the squirrels are done green. <laughs> The rest are just going to be left brown. Some Christmas yeah, trees. Yeah, look at the Christmas trees. Do some holly. Most of the holly's got eaten before we decorate it. We're off to go and get the Christmas shop from Waitrose. We actually cleaned my car earlier. You should have seen it before. Like, it was so. It was at the point where I couldn't see out my windows because they were literally like <laughs> black. I got a piece of tissue out because I literally couldn't see out and wiped them and it was black. Beep, beep. I'm back on the roads, bitches. <laughs> guys so i think the last time i vlogged was when jed and i were in the car lots of food has been consumed since then lots of alcohol has been consumed since then but i thought i would just hop on and show you what i bought in a boxing day sales oh god my camera's flashing red so i didn't actually get that much because to be honest there wasn't a lot but there was one coat that i really wanted that went in the sale so i'll show you that as well so ignore the mess in my bedroom it needs to tidy up but i don't know how well you're going to be able to see this this is the first thing i got just this core jewelry ribbed top has like a little collar there and then a pocket on the front here 
I ordered a small and an extra small, and this is the extra small. And to be honest, I think I could have got the extra, extra small in there. Same for the joggers as well. I think I could have got an extra, extra small in them. I wanted like a matching kind of set like this because I don't have, apart from like grey joggers and like black joggers, I don't have anything that's matching. And yeah, I just really liked this. So yeah, I've just got it on with some Air Force and I think it looks really, really nice. And it's actually really, really comfy. So this was £15 and the joggers are actually on sale now for £15. For reference, I'm a size 10 and I'm 5 foot 4. And that's how the joggers fit on me. You can see they're not touching the floor or anything, which is absolutely perfect. Just like a really nice wide leg jogger. And then my favourite thing that I got, I literally had my eye on this for ages. And I was like, do you know what? I'm going to wait until after Christmas to see it goes in the sale. And it did. So it went down from 60 to £35. And I am just a given set. So it's from H&M. And it's just this gorgeous like mongolian fur trimmed purple coat like oh my god this is just amazing they had it last season in blue um oh, it's got fur around the arms and this fur collar and then also a belt which you can tie up with all sizes are still in stock so if you want it be quick because i think these are going to sell out again like they did last year with the blue one my camera just died whilst i was talking about that jacket but yeah i'm obsessed with that jacket so much i also got some perfumes from zara now i still cannot smell so i actually can't smell what these like i actually went off people's recommendations first one that i got was yellow velvet and i feel like with these ones as well is when these ones go on sale that's it like that's normally them gone because this isn't even like a special edition one it literally is just like in a yellow bottle and it happened with one of my favorite ones from a few years ago which was joyful tuberose and they don't do it anymore they do i think just like normal tuberose if they even still do that so this one is yellow velvet and it's notes of peach orchard and vanilla and these were all 7.99 on sale and then i've got gold which i've heard is meant to be a dupe for lady million and then the second one i got is bright rose and i think this one is like musk something else and i can't remember what this one is but i'll leave them in the description box anyway if you guys want to get them and these ones are 7.99 as well but i just thought these bottles are so nice like these are ones that you'd have on display i'm just cutting it in it's actually the next day now the things from asos arrived yesterday so i thought i'll just show you them this morning because it's a bit dark yesterday so the first thing was this dickies t-shirt they also have this in black Grey. I don't know if the black one's in the sale and pink pink's in the sale as well for £13 this one was £12 and the grey one is also £12 I did really like the grey one but they only had it in a small this one I got in a medium don't throw them like that see <laughs> um, and then the second thing I got I figured we're going to be in masks for a long time so I picked some more and they're 100% cotton it's just a purple one a blue one and a pink one and they've got like these scrunchy um what are they called scrunchy scrunchy tie things what are these bits called that go with your ears put it down and it's also got the nose wire which you can just figure in there i mean what is 2020 when i'm showing you the mask i thought but yeah that's it so switch back to me yesterday now but yeah i'm gonna sign off this vlog here if you enjoy it please do give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and um my next video will probably be in the new year so i hope you all have a lovely new year's eve whatever you're doing i'll see you all in the new year bye